An independent filmmaking crew learned an important lesson last week. Always get your permits and notify all local businesses that you're making a movie. The Crawfordsville, Indiana police were called to the Backstepped Brewing Company last Tuesday on a possible robbery in progress call. When they arrived, they saw a masked man come out of the brewery holding what appeared to be a gun. They ordered the man to drop it, and when he didn't react quickly, the police shot at the man. They missed, striking the building. The robber, Aka actor Jeff Duff, then doffed his mask and dropped the gun, shouting that he was making a movie. He barely escaped a fatal shot, according to bystanders, as a bullet whizzed by his head. It was very close at actor Philip Dameron to local TV station RTV6. I don't want to think about it. If it had hit him, we'd be having a whole different conversation. The Indiana State Police were consulted and determined that a unit called Montgomery County Productions was filming at the location. However, no one, not the production company or the brewery, had notified the police or nearby businesses about the shoot. Indiana State Police Sergeant Kim Riley said that, in light of that, the police shooting at Duff was understandable. When the police said drop the gun, he turns toward police pointing the gun. If you don't know it is a movie scene, how are you supposed to react? I know, if it was my situation, I probably would have done the same thing. Cody Swank, cooner of Montgomery County Productions, said both sides gained something from the encounter. There's a lesson to be learned on both sides of the spectrum from us as a low-budget movie company and from the police department on their quick reaction. I'm very grateful that the police department did their job to the best of their ability with an unknown situation. The Indiana State Police said the shooting remains under investigation.